Hi, I'm Christina Stanley, CEO of Fictionary. This video shows you how to name scenes using Fictionary software. By naming scenes, you'll have an after-draft outline and the beginning of a snapshot of each scene. This is a great way to start a story edit. Let's have a look how to do this in Fictionary. We're going to go to the Plot tab, which is where you see the scene name. Keeping track of everything in a story is difficult, and we're going to make it easier for you. We'll start by creating a snapshot of your story using scene names. By naming scenes, you're breaking down your draft into smaller, movable pieces. You can think of the scene names along with the story elements as scene cards for your story. So the first step in creating scene cards in Storyteller is naming each scene. We're going to call this scene Fired. And you can see that name appears up here on the left. Scenes are the building blocks of your story. Storyteller is designed so you can evaluate and revise your story on a scene by scene basis. So let's name a few more scenes. To name the second scene, you click on scene two, you click over here, and we're going to call this Debbie Buys Boat. And you'll see again that shows up here. So you can see on the left hand side we've added all the scene names. Scenes are mini stories with a beginning, a middle, and an end. The beginning of a scene can start with an entry hook. In this scene, the entry hook is someone getting fired, so I've updated the story element entry hook here. The scene middle is V tells S firing is effective immediately. I know V is Veronica and S is Shannon, so I'm going to use my own short form throughout my full revision. In the scene climax, V tells S to leave town, and the exit hook is S can't leave town. Let's say I decide the scene needs a stronger physical description of Shannon. For now, I'll add this to the notes panel so I can do this later. So now we have the basis for a scene card. You're going to continue updating the story elements as you work through your revisions. When you're farther into your revisions, you can start new scenes whenever there is a point of view shift, a change in time, or a change in location. Before moving on to the next step in revisions, continue with your first pass of naming all scenes. I'll leave you with one final thought. Storyteller has drawn the story arc for you. Act 1 goes from the beginning of the story to plot point 1. Act 2 is everything between plot point 1 and plot point 2. And Act 3 is everything from plot point 2 to the end. The story arc is going to help you see if your story is structured in the best way to tell a compelling story.